guys welcome back to my channel so here I am showing you the Valley of Rocks sometimes called Valley of the Rocks it's a dry valley that runs parallel to the coast in North Devon England it's about kilometer one kilometer or 0 0.06 miles to the west of village of Linton it is popular tourist destination noted for its herd of feral goats and for its la landscape and geology so the valley guys has good exposures of lenten beds so i'll show you that later as well the lenten area it's quite close by you can uh walk between the two area so it's not far so it's formerly the Linton formation that are among the oldest Devonian rocks in the North Devon and are highly fossilifarious also of note are the very glacial featured form when these areas was at the limit of glaciation during the ice age so fossilization mean a fossil from classical latin fossilis literally obtained by digging so meaning there's a lot of fossils there that you can dig out from the stones so you know it's like in the um, geographical area of um, Jurassic Coast so there you go so the valley is believed to owe its existence to the dissection by coastal cliff recession of a former extension of valley of the East Lynn River which n now meets the sea at Linmouth. So here guys while no one is around this is about I think about 8 o'clock in the evening so I am filming here on the top of Linton to Linmouth railway so basically this is the eating area here and you queue as well on the other side of it and then I think the fair when we went there um, this year 2021 is about three pounds per person so you have to pay by card because of the COVID restriction so as you can see here that is the queuing area this is your falling line here and then as you can see there are um, things on the floor that they draw so people can keep their distance on that time not very much nowadays here I am filming going down to Linmouth so the Linton and Lenmouth Cliff Railway is a water-powered funicular railway joining the twin town of Linton and Lenmouth on the rugged coast of North Devon in South West, West England. Linton and Lenmouth are separated by high cliff making it hard for people and goods to move between them. In the late 1800, interest arose in building a funicular or cliff lift to join them. The civil engineer George Croydon Marks played a key role in both its design and bringing in financing from his business partner, Sir George Nunes or Nunes. Local contractor 
Robert Jones was involved in designing the Panicolor's innovative braking system in the line constructions and maintenance in the first decades of its operation. In 1887, constructions commenced and a year later, an Act of Parliament authorized the Linmouth and Linton Lift Company to operate it completed railway was opened on Easter Monday in 1890. It has been in continuous use since, really. While early use was largely focused on moving freight, the, the funicular railway became popular with tourists and became mostly used for passenger travel. Its flat platforms were converted into the passenger carriages in 1947 in its world's highest and steepest water-powered cliff railway operation. So here guys just showing you the area of Lindbergh.